Heavenly Father, thank you for this wonderful day that we celebrate every year and should celebrate every day. The birth of your Son, the birth of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Help us to have a wonderful day and help us to the world understand it's not about the presence, it's about the man, the baby, who was given, who was given to us as a gift. Help us to have a great day today and help spread the word and spread the message. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right. The birth of Jesus. Set up. In those days, Caesar Augustus issued a decree that a census should be taken for the entire Roman world. And everyone went to the town to register. So Joseph went up from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea, to Bethlehem, the town of David, because he belonged to the house and line of David. <coughs> when he went there to register with Mary, who was pledged to be married to him and was expecting a child. While they were there, the time came for the baby to be born, and she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in clothes and placed him in a manger because there was no guest room available for them. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone on them, and they were terrified. But the angel said unto them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all people. Today in the town of David a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in clothes and lying in a manger. Suddenly a great company of the heavenly host appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven, and on earth peace to those who favor rest. Oh. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let's go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. The star that shone above the manger. Uh -huh. Sword! Sword, AJ, it's a, it's a shining bright star that shone to the Yes. So they hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby who was lying in the manger. When they had seen him, they spread the word concerning what had been told to them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds said to them. But Mary treasured up all these things and pondered them in her heart. The shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things they had heard and seen, which were just as they had been told. On the eighth day, when it was time to circumcise the child, he was named Jesus, the name the angel had given him before he was conceived. <coughs> what does circumcise mean? <coughs> name? They cut, they cut some of his mm -hmm. penis. They cut the skin, the foreskin off of the penis. What? Okay. Yes, it's circumcision. You know you're still, reco yes, you're still recording, right? They should record, yeah. you should record your face. Wait, wait. Uh, no, you have to record Biscuit out. Oh, he's so comfy. No, no, no. Come That's on, our baby in a manger. Daddy, when you were talking, Ready? he was like <laughs> sleeping like this. Onto, onto a grandma, a dog was born. <laughs> really? Swaddled in, onto swaddled in lion print, leopard print. Come on, Mom. No, what? Yeah. No, what? Ready? Okay. No. Rock, paper, scissors. 